When Ray Tensing is tried for a second time for shooting Sam DeBose, a new judge will be on the bench. That is because Judge Megan Shanahan, who handled the first case, has decided to recuse herself. Nine on your side's Tom McKee was in the courtroom for the announcement today and is here for the reasons, with the reasons for it, Tom. Well, Julie, that first trial ended in a hung jury, and the prosecution last week, as you may recall, requested a retrial and change of venue. But with Judge Shanahan taking maternity leave soon and her wanting to keep the case going forward, she stepped aside to let another judge give the case a fresh pair of eyes. Ray Tensing came to court Monday hoping to learn when he'll be retried for shooting Sam DeBose. Instead, he learned that Judge Megan Shanahan will not be on the bench in the case. I find that this court is otherwise disqualified to preside over the retrial of the state versus Raymond Tenzing. For now, the case is in the hands of Judge Thomas Heakin. All future motions and hearings will be conducted in front of Judge Heakin. However, Judge Heakin may recuse himself as well, having represented one of Sam DeBose's children in probate court. Judge Shanahan didn't give a specific reason for leaving the case, but it's well known she's expecting a child soon. Defense attorney Carl Lewis expressed surprise that the judge took the case to begin with, knowing maternity leave was coming. I'm shocked that she did recuse herself, and I think it's because of the of the interest of justice and time. The, the family doesn't want to have it delayed any longer than necessary. The move did not surprise criminal defense attorney Marty Penniless, who says key decisions must be made on a new trial date and change of venue. All of these things will have to be decided, and they should be decided in a timely manner. And this is something she won't be able to do at this point. Before leaving the bench, Judge Shanahan praised the defense team and Tenzing's family, the prosecution and DeBose's family, and even protesters whose actions she called peaceful and meaningful. I am glad and pleased and impressed with the fact that we are hopefully setting a new standard on how these cases will be handled. Now, the judge had special praise for jurors, saying they tried harder than anyone could have expected to reach a verdict. One other ruling today, the judge did order that juror questionnaires with personal information redacted will be made public by the close of business on Tuesday. Tanya, Julie. And a quick mention there, Tom, that we do know that the judge has said that he will know by tomorrow whether he will recuse himself. Judge Tom Heakin, that is, in this case.